Hello, boys and girls, my name is Halsasi, and welcome back to another day in Minecraft, where today we will tackle these various calls. What we have to do is connect the redstone signals down there uh, from the respective forms, and then also uh, have a water stream going back to the forms, uh, delivering the bone meal that comes from the farm there above. So I think I will jump right into it and do the first line, which probably is the uh, blue here that goes to the acacia tree form, which is the form behind the farm here in front. I misspoke when I said the blue line goes out to the acacia tree farm because it doesn't, it goes to our 2x2 two two tree farm and we have set up water stream and redstone line. So here we can actually test this. We can see a uh, signal lights up down here and shortly we should see a shulker box full of bone meal coming in here into this chest. And there it comes. Bum. And uh, the way uh, it works with this system, we have then to fill in the bone meal manually from there uh, to uh, these chests. Uh, because of the flying machine on top and the need that we have to get as many drops from the leaves down into the water system, um, I opted to not have a system that automatically can refill um, the, uh, the chest here. Um, would have been nice Maybe it would be possible by basically um, having a dropper elevator here below because on these two blocks we will also not have any uh, saplings falling down. Uh, but yeah, I think manually filling the thing works here for this setup. And for the bone meal request system, we do not have an encoder here on this end because over there we don't have a decoder. Um, what we do instead is we have dedicated lines coming in as signaled here by the colors. And then we have an kind of uh, uh, logic gate here uh, that determines how the different uh, pistons should be uh, set up over there. So this first part worked well. Um, so uh, uh, let's do the other ones. And the next one is probably here, the green one uh, that says mangrove. That's the one over there. So we have to bring this line over, probably down um, one block. Um, and then we just have to make sure that the green and the blue wire do not cross because we all know that can go horribly wrong. The green redstone line is hooked up here to the decoder of the mangrove farm. Although we don't need a decoder here because we just need a signal. We don't care about the encoding of the signal because we have one line Per farm. However, we need to get the signal here from the unloader down there to the decoder. And that's a bit different than the 2x2 tree farm, 
over there we just had a button saying uh, deliver us some bone meal uh, but here we actually want to detect when we run out of shulker boxes full of bone meal and the way this unloader works is basically this hopper is locked holding the full shulker boxes and by the looks of it we cannot really take a signal from this one so let's put a hopper here then this observer is only observing and let's put a glass block here so that's not powered and then we can go with uh, green concrete and then on here we will have something like this um, let's see if we have one shulk box here we get a signal strength of three that means here we have two then we have one and if we do it that way don't need that block um, and then have where do we need to go down there to that red block so probably we will go down here on this side and then uh, around somehow so torch there when we have stuff in there it's not lit as soon as we re remove it we lose the power here and this torch turns on and then basically what we will have here is an observer probably facing down so that we can take the the, the signal down there and hook that up but as uh, most often i don't have the building blocks on me uh, and with that we then can also um, i have my ice box here um, bit of regular ice uh, let's make this one, two, three, four, five. And as we are here, basically over that line, I want yeah let's let's fall down so let's have a bit of packed ice there then go a bit zigzaggy down in that direction so we can someone somewhere here have an item elevator for the shulker boxes of bone meal and uh, i will connect this redstone line there and i think all the other farms they should follow in a similar pattern all the delivery lines all the redstone lines are done as you can see down there and 
we have quite a bit more uh, stuff going on here. Here in places it's so densely packed that we have to uh, cover up some of the redstone so that it does not interfere uh, in other places, uh, especially when we have to take the signal from the uh, filling station to the uh, wherever we are taking the signal out towards our bone meal farm. Uh, we have to take the signal down, which is a bit ugly, um, I must say. Uh, maybe we could have done this differently by pulling it down on this side and then going under. But here on this side, uh, you can see uh, the supply lines are coming out uh, we have to nestle in all the redstone lines coming in down there we have uh, three red uh, green and blue coming in from that side plus the yellow one from there uh, lime is coming in from over there and it's a tight squeeze uh, in here between our bone mill farm and our first wood farm. So for that reason I have ripped out uh, this decoder here. Everywhere else it's still in place. And uh, we just have the same input and then a bit of uh, a delay going on here because the signal we get in is a short pulse and we probably need something a bit longer. So we have here a simple pulse extender which decays and uh, we still need a signal strength of at least six in order to uh, get a signal out. Uh, once the signal drops below 6 here, it does not reach this repeater. But I think that does it for today. Um, uh, with all the building I noticed um, it's uh, a bit inconvenient uh, uh, shifting and then being so slow. So maybe in one of the next uh, episodes we have to find ourselves some fast pants. But as said, that's something for the future. We will see what we will do next time. So don't forget to subscribe to not miss that. Until then, goodbye!